This uh, video is under hot water at Alan Downey's, uh, so he has a solar system, um, which uh, actually uh, it probably does need to be serviced uh, as we get into the spring next year because the pressure is only barely at two there. Uh, it needs new fluid at this stage. Uh, there's a Wiesmann controller uh, controlling the solar, uh, and the solar heats uh, from the bottom up. And it's also got a dump setting on it there, which is set to... Uh, it starts off at 80 and uh, it stops dumping at 78 out to the buffer tank. Uh, so that controller is all working fine. Um, they have an override switch for the hot water so if they want to boost uh, with the immersion they switch that switch from auto to on and it's very important they switch it back to auto otherwise the immersion is on all the time and the immersion is there. Uh, um, so that's the hot water side of things and under normal circumstances the heat pump heats the hot water and the heat pump sensor going out to the heat pump is the uh, the one that's labelled there, heat pump hot water sensor. And the other uh, S3 sensor is actually for this controller over here. So what this does is um, <coughs> uh, this controller here transfers heat from uh, the buffer tank, which is out in the uh, out in the um, shed, uh, into the hot water cylinder. Whenever the buffer tank is warmer than the hot water cylinder, and this is a winter thing, so in the winter when the buffer tank is being heated up, and if it gets warmer than the hot water cylinder, it automatically transfers uh, heat into the coil in that hot water cylinder. It just means we get more energy into the hot water tank from the heat pump and less energy from the immersion which is cheaper to use. Um, okay that's it. One aside here on their uh, reds. The reds stat on the landing is controls that uh, motor valve and that pump to pump hot water up to the reds. But there's a branch off there we can just see in the center of the photograph the two half inch branch offs. They're going to the, to the towel rails and they're, they're not controlled by the motor valve. So, um, uh, the towel rails will be on all the time, anytime any one of these two pumps are running the hot water or the heating. So for this solar controller, um, the instructions are there on the wall and uh, up at the top it tells you how to use it and what the buttons do and down at the bottom we have all the settings and what they're supposed to be set to. And then this diagram here is um, just the wiring diagram of how that um, transfer, that hot water transfer controller is wired and how it uh, it can turn on the hot water pump um, as well as the controller. The heat pump controller turns it on out of that output N06 and that this controller can also separately turn it on. 